are we so afraid to make a phone call? It's because we call it a cold call. It's fear inducing. It's as if we're going to call someone and the person on the other line is going to get angry with us or upset because we go in thinking that I need to get this other person to be excited to buy. But that's not it at all. The intention behind the phone call is to get the meeting. And when we change the dynamic on how that conversation starts and finishes, it changes the entire game. Let's follow our participants as they go on the journey of making those initial conversations with their brand new prospects. Got my list of 100 ideal clients that Elisa and I want to work with. So this is an exciting part of our sales process and it needs to get done. Got some calls to make. I need to go get my computer. It has all the slides. I, it's like I need Kim's hand right now, literally. A script. Also, um, Kim suggested that we walk when we talk to people, remember? Right. Let's do that. Walk when we talk. You're right. It's, yeah. It'll make me look. Nope. Walk and talk. Gotcha. I'm so nervous. <laughs> I'm gonna go get some water. Like, just give me. I just, I legit. You just, we need you to make a call. Okay. I just don't know if I'm gonna reach the right person, like the appropriate person, if I'm gonna go to voicemail. They're gonna yell at me, I don't know. It's just gut wrenching. This is Angelica calling. How's your Monday going? Yes, that's what I do. I help people expand their business, grow their business while taking away the hassle of managing their social media from them. See you soon. Bye-bye. <laughs> that went really well. <laughs> that went well. Okay, next. Um... I'm just sorry. I'm like super happy that what, that went well. Like I don't even know how to get to it. But one thing I kind of regret not doing is booking that appointment. Like why did I stop at? Wow. I think it's because I didn't expect her to actually say it. That like yeah, come by. Ugh. <laughs> Leaving your question. That script. Uh, hello, Lewis. My name is Alisa. How are you feeling today? Uh, good. That's good. Um, well, I, um, I, did, I did some research of your uh, business's online presence and I see a lot of opportunities on how it could be improved. And I was just wondering, um, how, can you tell me how many leads you're getting through your website a month? <laughs> Alright, thank you. Bye. Oh, absolutely. Uh, would you want to book a call for tomorrow? Fantastic. I'll just call you tomorrow morning. Okay, thank you. Bye. I definitely take a few deep breaths because it is always nerve wracking to um, imagine calling someone and, and then walking through things. And the reality is it's not as bad as you think ever, but it's always a bit unnerving to, uh, to, to do that, to pick up the phone and actually talk to someone. It gets, gets my blood pumping. Done some research on this particular uh, potential client, this lead, so I have a good idea of what they're about and uh, the kinds of questions that I want to ask them. So uh, that's, that's the biggest thing, is getting curious about what makes their world better. Well, not uncommon to uh, have a missed call. 
All right, let's go in for round two. Uh, let's see if Katie picks up this time. Deep breath in. Be in the moment. Hello, Katie speaking. Katie, this is Jay with Goodpin. How you doing? Hi, Jay. I'm good. How are you? I think I have a, an understanding of what went wrong with the other service provider. Um, but maybe if you can give me an idea of what you're trying to accomplish, then I can make a few different uh, proposals. How you feel? <laughs> it's so, uh, it's incredible how quickly you forget something so damn simple. Uh, you know, open with how are you feeling today? And you just forget it in the moment. I forget it in the moment. Um, I guess maybe the habit hasn't been formed yet and I think that'll change over time. Phone calls take practice. Don't worry about the script too much. You're going to feel nervous. You're going to feel a level of fear and anxiety the first time you make a phone call. Remember your number one intention. Get the meeting with the prospect. Even if that means you have to call back a second time to secure the date. I'm Kim Orleski and I'm ready for you to become our next sales knockout. Come check us out online and on our website.